Hey guys, this is Mago. Jimmy. What, what's today? Today is January 25th. Yes. It is the RuPaul Drag Race All Star 3 starts today. Season 1, or season 3. Season 3. So, and these are all uh, ones that have come back year after. I mean, they've already been on once. Yes. And none of them were ever in the top three is what we decided, right? Yes. All right. Let's go. Let's watch. Hey, kitty girl. Hello. <laughs> Blessed weather we're having today. Indeed. Can you believe it's already All Stars 3? Oh, blessed be. Do you think there'll be lots of twists and turns and shocks and surprises this season? Oh, bitch. And do you think some of the eliminated queens will get to rue turn for their rue venge? Mm hmm Oh, my God. They're not going to know what hit them. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Chad, the Drag Race Hall of Fame really isn't what I thought it was gonna be. Girl, you're telling me? <sighs> you look really nice in red, though. Thanks, girl. It's <laughs> your color. The winner of RuPaul's Drag Race All Stars received a one-year supply of Anastasia Beverly Hills Cosmetics, a coveted spot in the Drag and Race Hall of pajamas. Fame, and a $100,000 with extra special guest judge Vanessa Hutchins. Oh, hi. Oh, hey. oh, That's hey. how I roll oh, no. in I need to make amends for the fact that I came in here and just hit the cement and got dragged out like a dead body. Uh, uh, Twice. Okay. Yeah. Oh, no. I just farted. <laughs> <laughs> hey, kids. Daddy's home. Play me, my dairy queen. Wake up, wake up, wake up. There ain't no dream. I'm back. The Bayou Queen. Did it just get swampy in here? Oh, Chichi, that hat is your inner saboteur, and I want you to let it go. Your inner saboteur. Woo! Ah! A little too, yeah. I just broke my ankle doing that. <laughs> my name is Thorgy Thor. I was on season eight and I made the top six. Fourth and since the show, I found ways to focus. Oh. I think I'm going crazy. Oh, there is one. Sorry, that's gonna drive me insane. Already. Oh god. Oh. Round two, bitches! <laughs> Wow, I'm Kennedy Davenport from season seven, the dancing diva of Texas is back, baby. Yeah, <laughs> and I'm Phil. Oh my God, the look is white noise of ugly. <laughs> white that noise is very Chi Chi. <laughs> I think Kennedy is Chi Chi from the future coming back. Uh -oh. oh God. Well, hello. Who could this be? <laughs> starts officially i have just one more queen i'd like to introduce into the competition chandor is right there lock the door are they seriously doing this <laughs> say But I am the very first crown queen of RuPaul's Drag Race. <laughs> because reading is what? Oh. I can't wait to see how this turns out. <laughs> Big and milky. Girl, just like the drink, you give me the <laughs> Me too. I hate you. Shangela. I always thought her name was Angela, and people were just telling her to shut up. <laughs> <laughs> wow, Milk, you put a lot into this look. What, 2%? Oh, 
<laughs> Shangela, you have come tour, so far. Tour. Initially, your Jeez. makeup was kind of busted, and your outfits were a mess, and your personality was super grating. But look at how far you've come now. You are much older. <laughs> the library is closed, officially. The winner of today's mini challenge is... Vendela Crep. You've won a $3,000 gift certificate from L.A. <laughs> so, Miss Congenial, for this week's Maxi Challenge, you'll be headlining an all-star variety show. Gentlemen, start your engines, and may the best all-star win. How do you feel about the whole elimination setup? I like it. Do you? I'm just going to send the bitch home that I think is the strongest. Yeah. Really, it's exactly what I'm gonna do. Morgan is talking about she's gonna eliminate the strongest queens to knock out the competition. Yeah, Sweetie, that's a great yeah. strategy that you should not have said out loud in front of all these queens. All those other girls are gonna basically say, we need to get him. <laughs> Please stop talking. Okay. Welcome to the main stage of RuPaul's Drag Race All Star. Funny man Ross Matthews. You have a comeback. A comeback? That's two of my favorite things. <laughs> and the gorgeous Vanessa Hudgens. Yeah. Are you excited oh, to be here? Oh, I can't believe I'm here, baby. I'm so happy. This week, I challenge my gentlemen. Start your engines and may the best All Star win. Shangela, Aru, is the bus still running? <laughs> 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 Bibi, Sahara Benet. Really good. Bibi is the Lion King off Broadway, but she looks great. <laughs> she turned to me and went, <laughs> and I was like, oh. <laughs> <laughs>
Morning with Back, 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 back yeah. again with more Fantasy League fierceness. Clock the yeah, runs for a sad. chance to earn points. Was, Here's your second word, kitty girl. Aja. Ben de la Creme. You are the top two all-stars of the week. Congratulations. Chichi Devane and Morgan McMichaels. You are in the bottom two. Each of you her. needs to decide which of the bottom two you will eliminate if you win the lip sync. So while you queens deliberate in the workroom, <laughs> kind of the judges and I <laughs> will never, watch Vanessa and Porkchop yeah, lip sync for their lives. Because yeah. <laughs> that's now going to backfire. You may that. leave the stage. Oh, hope they Coming up, hope I really wish them. you would have gave more. <laughs> This is your chance to impress me, win ten thousand dollars, and earn the power I to give one of the bottom the queens the chop. <laughs> the time has come. I like her better. Lip sync. Go, go, Mendela. <laughs> She's killing it. Good for her. Good for her. Yay. Bendela. Bendela Crap. Yes. You're a winner, baby. <laughs> 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 Bendela Crem, with great power comes great responsibility. Which queen have you chosen to get the chop? You guys are both super fierce queens, but, and when we as a group talked about why we might eliminate somebody moving forward, we talked about that we would not want to make that decision pretty much unanimously based on knocking somebody that we saw as fierce competition out of the way. And you were very forthright in saying that that is something that you would do, and in the interest of everyone moving forward, I chose Morgan McMichaels. Yes! Morgan McMichaels, yes, sir. you are and will always be an all-star. Thank you. Now, sachet. Yay! Don't give me that commercial so one. This ain't no commercial show. This it's is high fashion, baby. What's going on with you? Day. You're not confident. Actually, I liked it. Especially because Morgan needed to go. <laughs> I just felt like what she said out loud made her go home. And she would have been cutting people who really should stay. Yeah. And that is, I think, part of the game, yeah. is that it really should try and let the ones that should stay, stay. And cutting off somebody you think is the best, cut somebody short who really is the best. Yeah, I, I, yeah, I, I just, you know, felt like I, I, I wanted to be small, so, so happy. So you're happy, too. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You sound a bit sad. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Well, I mean, if, if, anyway, you know, if somebody's going home, like, it's, it's, it's kind of sad. That was not sad. This one was not sad at all. <laughs> not at all to me. Um, she, no, I was willing to, I was, I was willing to give her the benefit when she first showed up and she looked good and then she opened her mouth. Yeah. And she basically said what she shouldn't have said mm -hmm. and any single other one of those queens on there would have completely voted her off first and that's exactly what they did and that's exactly what I did. Oh, Linda did a great job. Yay for her. Good job. Yeah. Yes, she did. I want to see that again. Tussle. In fact, we're going to watch it again yeah. here in just a minute. Tussle going like that. He's got happy tassels. <laughs> <laughs> that's so funny. All right. This is it. Okay, See. we're going to watch parts of this again, so I'm rewinding. See you next week. Bye. Bye. Bye.